Hey everyone, welcome back to my another After Effects tutorial. This is the Simple Logo Animation Season 1, Episode 2. Today, we are going to create something like this. So let's get started. Open After Effects and create a new composition. I am calling it Shine Logo Animation. And using 1920 by 1080 frame size. As always, let's create a new solid for our background. Click on this color box and choose the color of your choice. I am using dark blue color. Now, we are going to add this texture to our background. Download link is in the description. Import this image into your project, and add above the background layer. If you don't see your blending mode tab here, right click here, and in the columns section select mode. Now change the mode to divide, and you will get this kind of background. In case you don't like the color of your solid background, you can always change it. Select your background, go to layers and then solid settings. Here you can change the color of your solid as you want. I am going with this color. Now, add your logo to this composition. You can also use any text you want. Place your logo on top of all layers. Now right click and pre-compose your logo. Let's call this logo. Now the important part. Make your logo comp 3D by clicking on this cube icon. If you don't see this tab here, right click here, and in the columns section select switches. And then click on the cube icon to make it 3D. Now go to the effects and search for card wipe effect, under transition. Add this effect on your logo comp. And change some settings. Change transition completion to 0%. And change rows to 0. Change column size to 15. Now, we are going to animate this card wipe effect. Go to around 4 seconds. And click here to add a keyframe on transition completion. Now switch back to the 0 seconds, and change transition completion to 50%. Your logo animation will look like this. Now, we are going to add few more keyframes to achieve similar animation. But before, press U to open keyframe and then go to the end keyframe. Now press P to open position and add a keyframe on it. Press R to open rotation. Now add a keyframe on this orientation as well. Perfect. Switch back again to the first frame, in the orientation, change last value to 180 degrees. Again press P to open position, and change the last value to negative 2600. Make sure your logo is not visible on the first frame. And your logo will look like this. Perfect. Let's easy ease all keyframes to make the animation smooth. Select your logo layer and press U to open keyframes. Select all keyframes, and press F9 to easy ease them. I want my logo to stop rotating at the time of card wipe animation stops. In the orientation select end keyframe and drag it to the left to change the rotation stop timing. You are free to adjust everything according to your need.
perfect. This looking good to me. Now add your website link or channel name here. Right click on this blank space, and create a new text. You can download this font from the link in the description. Type your text and align it to the center of this logo, like I am doing. I want my animation to start from here. Go to effect and search for 3D basic rotate Y cascade effect. Add this effect to your text or tagline. And your text is going to animate like this. Perfect. This text is animating nicely. Here is the last step. Now we are going to add shine effect on our logo. Go to effect and search for CC light sweep effect. Drag and drop this effect onto your logo comp. It will add this light effect on your logo. If you drag this anchor point you can see your light is moving. Let's minimize the card wipe effect to get some room for light effect. Change direction to positive 38 degrees. Change sweep intensity to 50. And change width to 30. Perfect. Now we are going to animate our light sweep to something like this. I am changing direction to 57 degrees, so it will look perpendicular to my logo edges. Cool, this looks perfect now. Now, add a keyframe on the center by clicking on the stopwatch icon. Go to around 6 seconds and change the direction of your light sweep. Drag this anchor point to the right to change the, the direction. Now your logo will look like this. Ramp preview this and adjust the timings if you want to change anything. You are free to adjust the timing of rotation and position according to your need. I am just showing you the way. I am going to easy ease the keyframes of this light sweep animation. Select your logo layer, and press U double time to open all the minimized keyframes. Make sure to select CC light sweep effect keyframes. Select both keyframes and press F9 to easy ease them. You can also trim out your playback time by marking the time. Press N to set the end timing. Ramp preview this and you are good to go. In case you want to change your logo property or even your logo, open logo comp and change anything you want. This is the benefit of putting your logo in pre-comps. You can change your logo anytime you want, without repeating all these steps. Make sure to align your text with your logo size and position. You can download the project file and sound effects from the link in the description below. In the next tutorial, we are going to make this.